Alright guys, episode 4. Man, episode 3 was... The ending, man, it was... That was a shocker. Previously on Life is Strange. Whoa. You don't know who the fuck I am, or who you're messing around with! Don't ever touch me again, freak! Let's talk about your superpower. What are you doing here, Max? Stop! Don't come near me! Not now! It won't work! I know this isn't pleasant for any of us. Miss Coffee, please, tell us everything. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. That's Rachel's bracelet! Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet?! Calm yourself, alright? It was a gift. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Welcome to my domain. Let's find what we want and beat it. Max, you better come check out these files. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. Listen, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank. Being more than a friend. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? No, you don't. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> Hello? Are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Max Caulfield. Hold on. Chloe! You have a visitor! We took money from the candy cap. Oh man. Karma. So, I was thinking, I think the fact that we saved her dad, I think that was part of the game. Like, we, we were always supposed to save her dad, I think. Because on the end result, it didn't have an option where, like, people save his dad, her dad, or did not save her dad, so. Oh, yeah, and then we lost a bunch of whales. Now we're friends with Nathan. He's not gonna spell anymore. Dang it. Chloe's a cripple, dude. Changed a lot. That shit was for the best. What I'm most concerned about though, are we still friends with Kate? Cause, you know. We, what was, what was we saved her from jumping and is in this version of the, real, of the reality, is she dead? Cause, it, it's gonna suck if she died. Like, come on. I really like the blue hair too, man. Shoot. I guess that's how the game took a turn. Beach whales. Did they beach themselves? Or the water just like put them there. You know what I mean? Episode four, dark room. Chaos theory, man. That, that episode. See, you know, this game's good. It left you in suspense. I wonder what happened. She got like a. Pipe going through her throat for breathing, I assume. Let's see, rough. It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. Yeah. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. So Max, so pretentious. But I love writing on it like an English poet. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. It's kind of rough hearing that voice from Chloe. You imagine that badass girl, and then Not totally. this is what she turns out to be. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, 
Pretty much. Yeah. Well, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. See? Without you here, I'd have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Those beached whales are so sad. I kind of know how they feel. At least, I'm alive here with you. You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Damn. Talk about the accident, huh? Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Damn. Do you remember everything? I saw everything in bullet time. I felt my back snap and... and that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Jesus. I, I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. You mean Rachel? You mean Rachel Amber? When was the last time you talked to her? Uh, never. I just read about her in the news. I didn't even know her name. You did? This is such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. It is. It might be. It might be, but... I'd like to think... Now we we're by ourselves, huh? For the better. I'd like to think that too. But I don't have much hope these days. I know things seem out of control, but... As long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe. I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. That was wrong. You're my best friend. Max. Thanks for coming out to see me. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? It is hella cold out here. This hella? Snow, yeah. I hate that word, no offense. Really? None taken. Damn, she's a different person. It's like a whole new person. Yeah, that's rough. I thought it, the, the thing was, was going to be about all those birds that was flying turned out to be whales. Pretty high tech layer. Feels like a high tech cell. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. I know it's hard for them. They're grateful you are here with them. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, you know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive, when you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I Damn. take a dump so she can wipe my bum. This sucks. Or when doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks again for coming, Max. I, uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Uh, can you can you bring me some water? 
No ball. We got you. Alright. Damn, can we talk? Oh. That must be her mighty morphine machine. Is that a reference? No more bongs for her. Is that the reference to the Power Rangers? What's this? Oh man. She has to use that ventilator just to breathe. It's rough. At least Chloe doesn't weigh that much. That's not so good. Does Chloe look at the garden and think about her childhood? Yes. She so. can't even feel the grass now. That's a serious heat lamp. Oh, teddy bear. Hello, Chloe. <laughs> she likes fluffy animals now. Oh, the snow doe. I guess not everything changed. Something. See the same, huh? Snow globes are taking over. Uh, that's all she can do now. Yeah, there's the lighthouse again. Wheelchair. I still can't believe I put Chloe in that chair. Maybe save her dad and she has heard him. Huh? It's nice my parents sent a card at least. I wonder who this is. Kind of a generic card. Me. I wasn't very available to Chloe. Real nice. At least I sent road trip selfies to Chloe. Damn. I'm sure that made her feel great. Yeah, how about make it sad? This is... I should offer to put makeup on for Chloe. Not that I can, but it would be fun. Chloe is still a punk at heart. Interesting. But she can't stage dive anymore. That's so cool that Chloe has made friends online. Quantum Leap, huh? Interesting. You know, I've seen his mouth breathe control on some Twitch streamer guy. Can't oh, remember. Chloe can totally control her computer. It's so great people get this high tech help. <clears throat> he like, I think he played PUBG with it or something. So cool. There's the old Chloe. Can't wear that anymore, huh? Huh, get you the water you need. Drink up, Buttercup. Oh man, no wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? Damn. I wish I could punch your face right now. A podcast? Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. Hmm. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's it's rough seeing her like this. Time. You sound like an adult now. Seems like we were kids in our life. Do you remember? What do you remember about us as kids? We all have different memories. I think about us as little pirates running and jumping through Arcadia Bay. Me too. But we're still pirates in our own way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. Check me out, Chloe of the Caribbean. Ooh. No way will I get on a fucking boat now. Unless you're with You're me. just gonna be sitting, doing nothing, and I'll be rolling. You have me. I'm not leaving you, Chloe. Well, you didn't visit me a lot either. I mean, I loved your cards and photos, but... I know I wasn't around much. No excuses. I'm a loser. Damn. But I am trying to make things right. Same. How? Dude, you're not Supermax. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. I know this is a dumb question, but... How would they? Are you lonely here? Yes, dumb question. I don't mind being alone. I can't exactly go party like a rock star, though. Or get an 18 trouble with the folks. I think Joyce and William are incredible. Max, the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks, and the medical bills are fucking insane. Can they pay? Can they pay all the bills? No way. They keep the numbers away from me, but it doesn't take much research to find out I'm costing my parents almost a million dollars a year. Chloe, you're priceless. Uh, hmm. no pun intended. No pun intended, indeed. You are such a geek. That's why I love you. Of course, I know a geek when I do. Right? 
See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. <laughs> what do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Chris. Yeah. I know. You would look incredible with blue hair. I'll bet. Now let's get this show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when you watch movies. I remember, Max. I swear I won't fall asleep. Yeah? Not when you're here. Not yet. It's probably the first time I've been here in a long time. Max is so cool that you're here again. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad you... Oh my god. I made that mix for her when we were 12. I'm glad she's so good. This is this one. Aha! Here's the DVD. Aha! Now let's play some. D Last time, I let me take all these doors. Actually, make sure. Bathroom are a mass gas mask option. So, uh, uh, yeah. Let me just make sure. Nothing but medical supplies. Cause I know I lost a lot of stuff. Thanks. I uh, think you missed a grain stuck in my eyeball. Yeah? <laughs> Hard to believe how just a little sand can cause such a big mess. It's like that Chinese proverb. A spark can start a fire that burns the entire prairie. You know, that butterfly thing. <laughs> Ooh, butterfly so flag. Oh, trust me, girl. I know what you're talking about. Real hard. She has to use a lot of lotion to keep her blood circulating. Alright, I check everything. I don't, I don't want to miss anything. Wow, sir. Chloe was a straight A student. Damn. She could have gone to any college. Blackwell. So that, we are in high school, okay? I don't know. I keep thinking it was a college. Gutless bastard. I am so glad Chloe stole your bullshit fund. Even if it wasn't another reality. Huh. So it's a good thing we stole the money, huh? I don't feel as bad anymore, y'all. I don't feel as bad. Alright, let's put this DVD in. Let's play some music. Alright, pull up a chair. Let's go, come on. Yep. <laughs> yep. I got nothing. Which are some sounds other than airplanes. Nice movie, I suppose. That cannot be comfortable for you, dude. The back, my back will ache so much if I sleep like that. Close to awake. <laughs> oh, never mind. I just can't tell. Maybe she was awake. In fact, earlier than us. I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. Oh, she fell asleep. Never mind. I was, I'm stupid. I know you were beat down after the day with me. And Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Do you, do you think Deckard is a replicant? Sorry, I can see you're not wide awake like me. No, I'm sorry I crashed so hard. Were you okay? I do have a mother and father when you're not falling asleep on me. Yeah? You are a bitch in the morning. It's the company I keep. Yesterday was such a blast. It was great. Seeing you. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like when we were little pirates jumping and playing the forests again. It meant Shiver me to me just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. Uh, 
fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you pretty please go upstairs and get my, my morphine injector in the bathroom? Morphine injector? It's, uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep the swag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? Arr. I'm on it, Chloe. Alright, let's get this drug injected in your body. What is that sign on there? Man, Joyce and William built a whole new bathroom for Chloe. <laughs> They're so great. Interesting. What's up, William? Kinda weird seeing you here, David. Damn. This is just for Chloe's basic supplies. Shit! That's a big eight grand! Eiffel Tower. Bonjour. That's great they finally went to Paris. Well, at least they enjoyed that. Come over to the next one. Cool. Let's show you some spots right here. Let's see what I'm talking about. Silence. You want to talk about something? Oh, let me see. Where's our text? Well, Chloe. Here's the Max is William. I want to contact Chloe. Can you just know what you want to do? How do you text? Hmm. Uh, Alexa, I can't hear this. You are very different. Sorry, TPM. Hmm. So Alexa's against us. Scroll, scroll, scroll. scroll. Build right there. Yeah, so we have a class on this page. Okay. Yeah, let's get some some just like this over here. Let's go higher than these, man. Let's go higher than these. Come on. Let's get some over there. Oh, don't have to win. Thank you for the time of money. Taylor? I think you're talking to me to see my mom again, John. You for the other set. That ass, man. Chloe, Dad. Huh. Mom. Oof. No, two, whales, three. Peace. Oh, Warren want to go to Wales with us. Hmm. Car keys. To think that our destiny is linked to goddamn car keys. It's crazy. These whales are just a preview of the tornado to come. And the Prescott Foundation? Jesus. Wasn't there a whole whale saving thing with the fishermen? Rachel thing? Amber is even missing in this reality. I guess I can't change everything. Yeah, guess you can't. They might get their own home taken away because of medical oh, bills. That's a lot of bills. That's terrible. Hey, William. Um, am I bothering you? Why, yes, Max. I love going through bills. <laughs> Kidding. How can you bother me? I haven't seen you in forever. I know. Yeah. You look exactly the same. <laughs> it's so cool. Help it. Good. Or I'd be scared if I didn't look like me. <laughs> of course, you seem more adult now. So what's on your mind? A lot of things. Start with Chloe. I don't know how to say this, but... I'm truly sorry about what happened to Chloe. Me too. All it takes is a few minutes to change a girl's whole life. But she's alive. She's been a trooper. Is she mad at me for not staying in touch? She should be. I have no excuse. She was disappointed. But she knows you care. And I know how hard it is to process all this. It's taken us years. 
William, I just want you to know that whatever happens, I'll always be here for Chloe. Always. I know you will, Max. Oh, pear trip. So you finally made it to Paris. Oui, as they say. <laughs> Not me, because I can't speak French. But it was a great experience, especially for Chloe. I can see her loving it there. You guys rock for going on a family adventure like that. She talked about going to school there, but that's not practical anymore. Yeah, of course not. It's not fair, Max. Life isn't fair, huh? Being around you and Joyce again is so nostalgic. Very old school, as they say. <laughs> old school. I think it's great for Chloe to see you. Makes Joyce happy see her too. too. So it's not all bad news in Arcadia Bay. Well, we got some dead wheels, so I think it's uh, it's pretty bad. Still, crazy weather. What do you think is going on with all of this crazy weather and animals dying? Nobody knows, right? It is Nostradamus type shit, pardon my French. But all I actually care about now is Chloe and Joyce. My family. Oh, Rachel. I was reading about that missing girl. Rachel Amber. Oh, yes, yeah, she went to Blackwell, right? Oh, poor thing. That's a real nightmare for a family. I'll bet it is. I get scared thinking about Chloe and that we might lose her. Someday. We actually lost you. The Prescott family might be bad news. What do you think about them? Evil. Next question. <laughs> Sounds like you know them well. More than I want to. But Joyce has to work for those greedy bastards at Panda State. Joyce works there now? I don't even like to think about it. What happened to the diner? I was impressed by Chloe's room and all the high-tech equipment. Sure oh, she's in trouble. We need a morph injector. Wait, wait. <laughs> Stop acting William. Come out. Insurance helps, but uh, I don't know, Max. I know it must be hard on you guys, financially. These bills are more like crushing. We have to mortgage our home, and that's pretty scary. I'll bet. But, but we'll get through it. Price is always right. Get it? No? Isn't that show? I have to go see if Chloe needs anything. It was so great talking with you again. <laughs> you act like it's the last time. And please, keep me from these bills whenever you want. Is that a swear jar? No change to spare anymore. Huh. Now it's back to cookies. Interesting. This is. Choices of food coupon boss. Wait, no. Focus. We gotta get the morphine injectors. <laughs> Ooh. Joyce and William never had a garage sale before. Selling stuff now. They're drowning in debt. Just to take care of their daughter. Such bullshit. Something still the same, huh? Excuse me. Is that Joyce? No. Nice. It is so nice to have you around. Joyce. That is such a sweet shot of Chloe. I wonder who took the picture. Excuse me, I need to find some William more trying characters. so hard. He's still awesome. Look at them. They have no idea what's in their future. Yeah, he was dead. More bills? Oh, no. I didn't realize how bad Chloe's injury really was. She didn't die? So I just ran? Smoking. Oh. Joyce used to hate smokers in the diner. Oh, it's good for. She's smoking now. Joyce is already a super mom. Hey, Joyce. Good morning, Max. Oh, you and Chloe are so much quieter now than when we were kids. I remember. It's nice waking up in your house again. Oh, William and I love it. Finally seeing you and Chloe together after all these years. After the accident. It's rough. I have to tell you how much I love seeing you and William together again. He's been such a hero through all of this. Chloe and I, lucky to have him. Is William still the same? 
after everything that's happened. For better and for worse, but always for the better. I, I never thought I'd love a man so much I can't imagine life without him. Oh well, you were living with him for Sounds a while, I know. You rule, Joyce. Shit, things would be different if I did. I like how you think, kid. I wish I was a better friend. I know Chloe doesn't get many visitors. Oh, Max, you're Chloe's best friend for a reason. You're here exactly when she needs you. I hope so. I hope so. You guys do such an amazing job taking care of her. We can only do so much, and she gets damn it's sick of her parents. <laughs> That's why it's so important you came to spend time with her. Max, Chloe's condition is not improving. Yeah, it's weak. Her respiratory system is very weak, and she. Do you know what I'm saying? <sighs> Choice. It's I'm rough. so sorry you have to go through all this. Bad or good, I embrace every moment with my daughter and my husband. This is what it means to be a family. And we'll always be one. No matter what. How are you doing, Joyce? I'm doing the best I can, Max. I won't lie, it's difficult. But nobody said life was easy here in Arcadia Bay. Yeah, I'll bet. How about David? Do you know somebody named David Madsen? He, um, might hang out at the two wheels. Well, that was random. Yeah, he's a, a bus driver. He comes in sometimes. Cute, quiet. Why? Oh, um, I, w I was just curious. What a weird you question always were. Nice to see that everything doesn't change. Granted, I did choose that question to ask you. So... What do you think is going on here with all of this eco-havoc? Maybe Arcadia Bay just wants to be left alone. I know the feeling. Honestly, I don't give a shit about too much outside our house. Never heard you curse. I don't blame you, Joyce. She ever curse back in Now we have dead birds and beach whales outside our front door. So maybe I should care, for Chloe's sake. It's hmm. a lot of work. Plus, eh? you guys have to work too. Uh, Bill and I have no time for ourselves. And we're working more than we're living. Mm. I even had to take a part-time gig at Pan Estates. Ugh. Do you know the Prescotts? I know that Sean Prescott won't be happy until he owns everything in Arcadia Bay. Mm. Stay mm. away from his son, Nathan. I, I better will. get back to Chloe now. It's good talking with you, Joyce. Yeah. You too, honey. Fuck Nathan. Still gonna rat him out. Had a gun. I'm still on that. Regardless of this universe or, or the last one. Alright, let's see here. Let's see shite. Cabinet, is that it? It's cool that Chloe uses natural medicine too. See this? Nothing here. See this? Bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. Is it this one? Oh, found it. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. Yeah, it's rough, huh? Well, oh, the, the the thing is gone. Oh, it's Chloe's room. It's so empty. I'm sure this is a total coincidence. There's no such coincidence anymore. At least we never had to hide from step douche. The height thing, us. I guess we stopped growing up together. Damn. Let's sit there later. This is lit. I never heard much about William's brother. Shoes. Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. Toys? I kind of want to open this and see what's in here. Open it. Open it. Damn it. Some crutches. 
They bought crutches for Chloe, hoping she might walk again. Sorry to break the news to you. Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. No, they Let's sit down and think about what we just did. I'm still overwhelmed by this new reality. All right. I feel so guilty for putting Chloe and her family through this. But I mean, at least they're together, right? Isn't that the, the question? Is it worth it? Having her dad back now? But now she's crippled and now they're also in deep, deep financial issues. Was it better than their last relationship? We did just home wreck them. Hmm. I guess that's the question. I will. Hey Chloe, I got the drugs. How do I? Oh, I just give it to you. Finally, uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. I'm nosy, but not precise. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. And pay my Hey, you know your dad's outside. We can just get him to okay, do this. But get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Did it work? Of course, my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good you day. Yeah. This is a good day for you? Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> Oh, man. You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Um, stop me if I'm being too emo. But can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Yeah, memory lane? Please. Got you. My diary is like emo ground zero. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Ever. Since we went through her, went through the the, the thing, you can't, because we took a photo with Chloe when she was normal, you know. So can't we do the same thing again? Or was that, you know, what I mean, like that, that should be an option. All right, memory lane. Hello. We'll be at. We'll be at. Oh my god, look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. And you laughed at me. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Next page. Oh, awesome picture. They look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over our Arr. hoodie, babe, when we had the chance. There's still time for you. Yeah, not for you, though. You better die. Corner that letter. Can't... The breathing's getting worse. Oh, man. There we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Yeah. Literally seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Me too. This photo... Maybe I could... No. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing. Serious? And, uh, and it's <laughs> only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So, I know I'm just... Putting off the inevitable oh, man. while my parents suffer along, and I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia oh, Bay no. and everything was possible, and you made me feel that way today. Oh, no. I want this time with you. Be my last memory. Oh no. You understand? Yes, I do. 
All you have to do is crank up the what? to 11. No. No. No, no, no. She has to kill it? Y'all, this is gonna be terrible, but see y'all next part, you know?